at uh, CS 2013 at uh, Rode. Is that how you say? Rode, yes. Rode. So, uh, Rode. Australian. So, um, Australian company. Uh, where does the name come from? Uh, it comes from uh, Peter Freeman, our, our founder. It comes from his family's Scandinavian heritage. Um, so, as a bit of a tribute to, to his kind of history, he's got the, the O slash with the road. So, what do you do at Rode? Uh, I'm the sales and marketing coordinator for Road. So, I kind of uh, do a lot of the uh, first contact emails and, you know, like kind of helping out at, at trade shows and booths like this. So, yeah. All right. So, what is that that you're showing here? Okay. So, this is the Rode IXY. It's a professional field recording mic for the iPhone, iPod Touch, and the iPad. Now it's the first microphone available, and the only one available, for iOS to do 24-bit, 96 kilohertz recording. So that's proper broadcast quality recording that you could use in any kind of production anywhere in the world. How does that work? So what we've done is we've actually bypassed the, the hardware limitations of the iOS by writing our own app that will actually talk directly with uh, the iXY. So nice. let me just boot so up the app. So that little piece of hardware there gets power from the iPhone? It does, and yeah. That's how, and it has electronics to record the highest Higher, broadcast stuff. Absolutely, so even higher than, than what's ever been available on the iPhone. Um, nice. So basically, this is the app. This is RoadRec. This allows you to record at 96 kilohertz, 24-bit. So let's just go into a recording. You've got a live wave form view while you're actually recording. And this is uh, not multi-directional, is it? Or yeah, so this is a stereo microphone. It is a XY uh, stacked pair. So basically you get stereo spatial surround without any kind of phase issues if you sum it down to mono because the sound reaches both capsules at exactly the same time. So if you've got space pairs and you're doing a, a, a close-up interview where you, you'd be holding the mic close to your mouth or something like that, then when you sum it down to mono, you might have a bit of comb filtering, uh, which is basically a bit of loss of bass frequencies and whatnot. So how much does it cost? Okay, it's $199. Uh, it comes with a windshield, and it also comes with a pod to keep it in. Can you show how the windshield works? Yeah, absolutely. So the windshield just pops straight on top, like so. And then if you're in somewhere where there's like a light breeze, or if you're doing a handheld interview and you wanted to talk into the mic like this, then you're not going to get pops and wind noise from your from your your breath. Since when is it available? Okay, so it's available for pre-order right now okay. uh, from ixymic.com or from roadmic.com. Nice. And yep. uh, so, how, how many do you think uh, expect will use this? It's going to be huge. Oh, uh, look, it, it's the uses for the ixy are endless. From anyone that's a, a musician to someone who likes going to concerts and recording to even electronic news gathering, on-camera DSLR audio. Uh, you can also use it there. Absolutely. So with the additional accessories that we'd be bringing out very soon, you can actually mount the iXY on top of a camera. Now, RoadRec can run playthrough, so you can listen live to the recorded signal. But the bonus of that is that you can then run out of the uh, iPhone headphone out directly into the mic in of a camera, and you've got dual system audio. So you can record on RoadRec, uncompressed, high quality audio, and then you've got a scratch, tra scratch track on your... Uh, DSLR camera that you can use for syncing later on. So I didn't quite get that, but uh, that, that means that you, you suggest that your recording through the iPhone, through that system, is higher quality than whatever the camera would be able to record. Absolutely. Your, your mini in, yes, for sure. definitely. Now, definitely. DSLR cameras have very low quality audio circuitry. As you can imagine, the preamp and whatnot are very small and, and very low quality. They're high noise, so the way to get around that usually is to, is to send in a, a boosted signal, like on the, uh, the VideoMic Pro or the Stereo VideoMic Pro, and that way you can reduce the preamp, which also brings down the noise. Now, the ideal situation is to have dual system audio, where you can actually record onto a device that has no noise to begin with, or at least very low noise, and then you can actually sync it directly to your video later on in post. So, it's not too hard. It's like a video editor. No, yeah, exactly. So if you, if you use uh, software, something like Pluralize, um, they're a company that we work pretty closely with. Um, yeah, you can just drag and drop your audio files and video files together. It will instantly sync it. Cool. That's kind of cool. Uh, how about Android? Uh, Android, we don't have support for as yet. Because the connector is only iPhone. Absolutely, yes. So. Are you planning? Uh, well, at the moment, uh, with iPhone uh, and the Apple products, it's known hardware. So because we've actually bypassed the limitations of uh, 48K recording, 
to be able to get 96k recording. Android at the moment has uh, you know a lot of different kind of hardware, uh, different manufacturers. So but we'll possibly use, look uh, at it in the future. Did you use min uh, micro USB, right? Mm -hmm. That would yeah. be the interface. It, it m most likely would be, yes. Yeah. Yeah. So I guess uh, that's to be seen if you if you stay tuned on the website. Nice. Can we walk around just to see? Are you showing other stuff, or is it just what you said? No, yeah. So I can show you a couple of the different setups. Um, so as you can see here, we've got. Uh, like a camera setup um, mounted with the playthrough running. Uh, if you come over to the next uh, section of the booth, so the actual mount um, for the camera setup doubles as a pistol grip. Now this is mounted with the uh, the Rode Dead Kitten. It's an accessory that's available. Um, it's universal across a lot of our different microphones. So anyone, even like someone doing field recording, or if you're recording at a wedding and you want to record some ambience later on to, to add as a as a, a layered track, um, yeah, it's perfect for, for those kind of guys as well. So. All right. So uh, how big is Rode? Rode's been around since the late 60s. Uh, really? Yes. So we now supply to countries all over the world. We've got distributors worldwide. Um, we sell into the broadcast market. Uh, we sell into the the music. Uh, musical instrument market um, in uh, mics for, for recording music. So, yeah, Rhodes, um, you know, as far as microphones go, Rhodes right out there. One of the top ones. Absolutely. But not the top, right? Oh, I, I, I don't know. It depends on who you ask, yeah. All right. Uh, competitors are, we don't need to mention them. Oh, I guess, yeah. yeah. I mean, everyone But how does the microphone work? Isn't it, isn't it, uh, isn't that a piece of cake? It's not no. just like putting stuff together and it just works. No, absolutely not. So at Rode, we actually manufacture um, our own capsules in-house at, uh, at Silverwater um, in Sydney, Australia. So uh, we've got our own facility where we actually make our own capsules. We've got absolutely the best technology available. Um, yeah, so it's a very involved science. Is that uh, made in China? No. No? No. So it's even the IXY, in China? IXY is actually made in Australia. Um, if you... Now we do have some accessories and whatnot that are made in China, but IXY, the whole the whole designed place. and made in Australia. So, where, Mr. Reader? In uh, at our at our headquarters in in Silverwater, which is right just outside of Sydney. So, how many employees do you have? Ooh, that's a question I don't really know the answer to. I think around about 70 to 100. So, right. yeah. Cool. Peut-être on apprend à se connaître. On révèle petit à petit. Parfois ce n'est pas à mon, à mon avantage, certes, mais j'aime trop dans un sens sortir ou avoir ma propre vie, ma propre indépendance.